Welcome back to another video on BC Exotics. Today I'm going to be unboxing uh, two parcels from Creatures from the North, which is a tarantula um, store based in Northern Ireland. Um, as you can see in front of me, I've got my two parcels here. Um, one of them contains a mystery box and the other one is just kind of an order. I think they put the site species that I ordered in one box. I did have to pay postage twice, but apparently because they are site species and they're kind of restricted movement around the country, imports and exports, etc. Um, they have to package them separately. So before I continue into the video, please like, subscribe and leave a comment down below of any video suggestions or anything like that as it really helps me out. So there's going to be two parts to this unboxing. This video is going to be kind of the things that I ordered and then I'm also going to be showing you their setups and housing them etc and I'll do that with the mystery box as well. So when I received the parcels they did feel slightly cold which doesn't have to be a bad sign but I'm not sure how like packaged like how they package them or anything like that and I have no idea what's in each of the boxes. And so I'm just going to be opening this one first to see what's inside of it. For more clarification, basically what I'm going to do is, um, in this part I'll be unboxing them as like from the package as well as the mystery box. And in the next part I'll be showing you the setups and their enclosures. This is probably my most expensive order I've ever made um, for tarantulas. I got some money for Christmas and I just decided to spend it all on this. I bought quite a few females. Um, I've never ordered from Creatures from the North before, but as you can see, the packaging does look really good as they've got lots of these uh, insulation kind of beads. Um, and then inside there's also this silver package, which I'm guessing has the spiders in it. It's wrapped in tin foil. Um, so it looks like in the box, they've also included uh, some chocolates, which is very kind of them. And then also, uh, advertisement of the Southeast Arachnid Show, and I'll be going to this. And they've also included a heat pack. Um, this is the winter box. They on it listed on their website how they pack them for the different seasons, and so this is still warm, and so the transfer should be all fine. And that's always a good sign. And they've also included a wristband, which is very cool. Same creatures from the north. Um, it's very good that they include all these gifts because most shops don't. It's it makes them stand out a bit, which I like. Nothing else in there. So let's get on with opening the parcel. I want to be careful because I'm not sure which way around or how it looks inside. Tightly wrapped. And then we've also got a paper layer for more insulation. That has a lot of paper. So I've just realised that my camera accidentally cut off. Um, but uh, basically inside the insulation box which is branded they've got a Creatures from the North card. Um, some extra kind of cotton padding which is very good for insulation. Um, it's actually really impressive how well they package their boxes. A lot of effort clearly goes into it. Um, and so, as you can see inside, these are all of the species that aren't site species. Um, there seems to be a lot in here. I ordered a £50 mystery box as well as quite a few juveniles and adults. Okay, so first we've got the N inside. I actually have one of these already. Uh, this appears to be a sling. And that's part of the mystery box, so I didn't order that. And then next we've got S. Azimai, I'm not sure. I'll put up the common names on the screen as I'm going through these so it makes it a bit easier. As you can see there, which is another sling in the mystery box. And then we've got another N inside. Maybe some of these are gifts, I'm not really sure. There's a lot in here though. And then H Famosus. I'm probably butchering these names, but oh well. 
and then we have a Nahandu Tripepoi, something like that, I'm not sure. Uh, and this, I think, would be £12, as they've got numbers. They didn't have the numbers on the handwritten ones, though, but I'll look and do a total calculation of how. So, carrying on, I have the Davos Fasciatum, something like that. Um, and that is eight pounds and you can see it at the top here it's a very small one I didn't actually order any slings and so all of these slings I have got all from the mystery box um, then we have the P Iomania something like that no idea uh, and that looks like it was 11 pounds So far I've got one, two, three, four, five, seven slings. So we've got eight slings, all from a mystery box. And for only £50 mystery box, eight spiders are ready is massive. Um, next we have the Feromic... I don't know, I'm going to attempt to pronounce that, you can see it on the screen. Uh, that was £18 and then Oratus. Uh, that one's actually quite big compared to the other ones. It's quite hard to see, but I'll be showing you their setups. And then we have four kind of bigger ones. Some of these are probably the ones I ordered now. Yes, yeah, so this is the Nandu Chromatus. I ordered this one. This is a, I think, seven to eight centimeter unsexed. And then we have the um, I I think it's just kind of shortened but this is i think it's the green bottle blue which was a six to seven centimeter unsexed i think if i'm right and then we have the oh yeah this is the lazadora paribana and this is a female this is meant to be a sub-adult female as you can see there and then lastly i have the Gramostola procruceps, procruceps, uh, the golden shake only. This is also an adult female. This was the most expensive one. And so that is everything from this parcel, as you can see. Uh, there's nothing else in here. So far, I'm on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm on 12 tarantulas, and I have two more in the next one. So as you can see in front of me, this is the other parcel same size box and so this probably has the same amount of packaging and insulation in it which is obviously great as you can see loads more of the polystyrene chips this box was also packaged exactly the same way and um, the actual box still feels warm from the heat pack underneath it um, and it was wrapped in tin foil in the paper like the other ones and so again a branded box i think these are really cool actually um because they must have been specially made and then lots of cotton padding which you can see here and then inside we should have two brachypelmas yeah so this is um brachypelma ahamori uh I think it was the four to six centimeter, as you can see there. Um, the only ones I've had of this species before have been slings, and so I decided just to get two as I really like them. Um, they're quite a like stereotypical first tarantula. See, they're not, but like I've had almost all the brachy palmer species or slitter cattle species as adults, except for the homories. And so, I mean, if one of them's male and one of them's female, I might possibly even breed them. Um, I have decided to do the um, setups and putting them in their enclosures and things like that in another video and so please subscribe and turn on your, your notifications to see that as that will be coming out shortly after this video. Thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed it.